Today for Mousetrap Monday, we're going to take a look at this plastic snap trap with all these teeth. This is called Mouse Over, the best rat and mouse trap. I first saw this when I looked up mouse trap on Wikipedia. This trap was one of the first featured in the photos, and this comes in a four pack. So let's take this out of the box and see what it looks like. So here's the Mouse Over trap. The way you set it is you push back this lever here opens up the jaws, you see all those teeth. There's a little bait cup there with a piece of plastic to hold it in place, and there's a spring. The way this works is the mouse or rat will come, step on that, and you know what? This is not very powerful. That does come down, that spring closes those jaws. It's very easy to set, and it does have all these teeth to hold it in place, but it's just not very powerful. No big deal at all to stick your finger in there. Let's go put some bait in this cup here and see if it actually works with mice. So let's go set up the motion cameras in the barn. Well, last night we set up the mouse over mouse trap and we got one. It went in there, got the bait and it tripped. But unfortunately this didn't die right away. It took a little while, which in my opinion, this trap isn't even strong enough to instantly kill mice. I would definitely not use it on any rats. It's a cool looking design, but it's just not powerful enough to release it. You pull back that lever there and I give it a little flip. It sets easy, but I just don't think that it's powerful enough and it's pretty big and bulky for how weak the spring is. And the other thing I don't like is if it snaps too hard, this just comes apart like that. So in my opinion, not the best trap. I probably wouldn't recommend it, but it did catch mice.